In the world of sewing, choosing the right needle can make all the difference. Let's talk about the anatomy of a needle. First, there's the butt of the needle. Then there's the round shank on the front of the needle. The butt is the part that goes into the sewing machine. And then you also have the shaft. That's the longer piece of the needle. And of course, you know the eye and the tip. And then on the back, you have the flat shank of the needle the flat shank goes towards the back of the sewing machine facing the back and then you have the scarf which the bottom bobbin uses this area to kind of grab the thread so it can actually make the stitch and now that we know the parts of a needle so let's figure out how to find the perfect needle for your next project and now we're in Joanne's. So we're gonna find a needle that can be used with denim or canvas. So I'm gonna grab these denim needles and I'm also gonna grab a pack of needles that have three different types in them. This pack has denim, heavy duty, and leather needles all in one pack. Now let's dive into what these numbers really mean and how to really pick the right needle for your fabric. Let's get into it. The smaller number ranges from 8 to 20 for the American numbers and 60 to 120 for the European numbers. The European numbers relate to the diameter of the needle. One millimeter needle has the number 100. Needles 860, 965, and 1070 are really good for very fine fabrics like silk and chiffon. And with the needle 1175 and 1280, you can use that one for lightweight fabrics like cotton voile, silk, synthetic, spandex, and lycra. And 1490 is good for medium weight fabrics like your cotton quilting fabric, jersey, muslin. And for your heavyweight fabrics like denim and corduroy and your heavy linens, needle number 16100 is good for that. And needle number 18110 is perfect for heavyweight fabrics. And with knowing all this, you definitely will find the right needle for your next project.